Hi, today we are on our ninth day. In 21 days, declare your healing. I wanted to tell you that my books are available in Amazon and Google and other platforms. So I have posted the links below. You can purchase the books from there. And my email address is provided. I would love to, I would love to hear from you. And also, if you have missed previous videos, you can go to the YouTube playlist, 21 Days Declare Your Healing, and you can find those previous videos there. Today, we are going to talk about disobedience. Now, disobedience also causes sicknesses and disasters. In the Bible, we read that many people, they went against God, they disobeyed God, and the reason of the disobedience, they faced many consequences, and one consequence of that was sickness and even they faced death. We see one example when David was uh, bringing the Ark of God back to Israel. David mobilized 30,000 special troops and led them to Baal Zuda to bring home the Ark of the Lord. Why they were bringing the Ark of the Lord and they arrived at the threshing floor of Nakon. And when they arrived there, the oxen stumbled and Uzziah, he put his hand to hold the ark and the anger of God came upon and the anger of God came upon Uzziah, Uzziah and Uzziah was killed right there because God commanded that no one will touch his ark and anyone who disobeys that command, they will be put to death. We also see another example, the sons of Aaron disobeying God and they were destroyed. Nadab and Abihu, the sons of Aaron, placed unholy fire, laid incense on the fire and offered the incense before the Lord because of that act. And he killed both the sons of Aaron. And in the New Testament, we see one more example. It is Ananias and his wife, Sapphira. Now, Ananias and Sapphira were in the New Testament church and they promised God an amount and instead of giving the whole price, they kept some portion for themselves. And when they come to the church to Peter, then Peter asks this question, that did, did you people sell your land for such a such price? And yes, they replied. Then Peter was angry and he said, why did you lie to the Holy Spirit? And immediately the husband died and later on the wife died. In 1 Samuel 15, 22, we see, had the God as great delight in burnt offerings and sacrifices as in obeying the voice of the Lord. I need to tell you that sometimes unknowingly when we disobey God, then we go through certain sicknesses. So sometimes the reason for our sickness is also disobedience. So if we come and repent in the presence of God and ask forgiveness, that God is faithful to forgive us and to heal us. I want to pray for you, Father God. I want to ask you forgiveness for anyone who is not obeying to your vo voice or obeying to your command. Because Lord, if we don't obey, then it means that we don't love you. When we don't obey Lord, we open doors for the enemy to bring sickness, infirmities, Lord. And when we repent and we walk back, those doors are closed and the healing comes. I'm praying right now to those who are watching to this podcast. If anyone is not heeding to your voice, then Abba, speak to them so that they could repent and come back to you and would follow what you have commanded them. Lean on to you, Holy Spirit. And when they will do that, the complete healingness and the wholeness will come in their bodies, in their life, in their marriages. Lord. Thank you. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. I encourage you to go back to God. I encourage you to go to God and check your hearts and see, is there in any place that we are not obedient? Because that would be an open door for a sickness. God bless you. I believe in this 21 days, God will definitely heal you. God bless you.